from Sprinkle with Soil and today we are going to be painting our chicken coop ink black. Black is the color we decided to go with because M specifically requested a shade that turns navy blue in the evening so we will see how it goes. Uh, we decided to go with a satin finish for the exterior paint because it would be easier for us to clean. Chickens are not necessarily the cleanest um, animals to take care of. So this will make it easier for us as we start wiping things down and, um, and washing things for our coop. In addition, we're using a 3M sandpaper to sand down all of the existing paint on our coop. We also picked up a paint spray gun for our first time. We're gonna try to see how this is gonna work because we wanna be able to get a, a smooth, straight finish. All of these items we picked up at our local Home Depot. We've also partnered with wearable masks to keep us clean and safe during this process. There will be a lot of debris flying around as well as paint. And with wearable masks, not only are they comfortable and breathable and reusable, there is a slot for a PM 2.5 filter to filter out any particulate matter um, uh, that will be flying around. So we're very excited to get started on this weekend project together and uh, let's get started. All right, so we've had this coop for about six months now and you can see it's already collected some debris on the very top. And so what we're gonna do before we get started on the project is to spray it all down, clean it up um, right around these edges too as well. We're gonna wipe it down, clean it up, sand it and start painting. So there you have it. It took two and a half hours to complete this project. I hope you were inspired. If you want to watch more about urban homesteading, please click down below and subscribe. Bye.